the so-called Sussex Squad, a nickname for superfans of Prince Harry and Meghan Markle, have been slammed for making up claims about the senior royals. Sarah Vine, a Daily Mail columnist and royal commentator, told Mail Plus Palace Confidential that it was such a shame that the Sussex cheerleaders are so determined to find offence every time a senior royal reaches out to the California-based couple. It emerged earlier this week that Prince Charles keeps a treasured photo of him with Meghan on display in Clarence House. The endearing photograph, spotted earlier this week, was seen as an olive branch to the Duke and Duchess of Sussex. The snap appears to show Charles escorting his new daughter-in-law down the aisle during her wedding to Harry. It was glimpsed this week when the Duchess of Cornwall hosted an International Women's Day event at Clarence House. Mail Plus host Joe Elvin. There was a small suggestion of an olive branch with the photograph of Charles and Meghan. Ms. Vine responded. The photo would be there normally. This whole idea that the senior royals never liked Meghan is all made up. It's just a fantasy. All these frenzied people who are desperate to find some sort of offence have decided it is the case. It was never the case. Prince Charles was so happy to have Meghan join the royal family and he offered to take her down the aisle. Daily Mail diary editor Richard Eden added. He was greatly honoured to be asked by Meghan. Ms. Vine said. They were really fond of her and they really wanted it to work. It's just a shame that so many of their cheerleaders are so determined to find offence every time. Despite the apparent olive branch, Prince Harry announced yesterday that he will not return to the UK later this month for Prince Philip's memorial service. Senior aides told The Sun that the Queen received just 15 minutes' notice of Harry's statement. It had been thought that Harry would travel to the UK for the Duke of Edinburgh's memorial in London on 29 March. Harry's absence crushes hopes of a renewed reconciliation between the senior royals. A spokesman for the Duke of Sussex said Harry still hopes to visit his grandmother the Queen soon but did not give a date.